But for the moment, we have a, a, great, uh, a great guest that I'm so excited to be having right here on the Rich Eisen Show. It is none other than Meatloaf, who's currently right in our green room on Fanatics Fan Day. Meatloaf is in studio next on the Rich Eisen Show. Signing a Yankee jersey right now that Taylor Lautner signed yesterday, giving it to us by Fanatics. Good to see Meatloaf here on the Rich Eisen Show. That is next. Don't you dare move. Rich Eisen Show, Falcons quarterback Matt Ryan will join us. Same with Pro Football Hall of Famer James Lofton. Mark Wahlberg and Deepwater Horizon will be calling into the show. But right now, thrilled to have here uh, in the Rich Eisen Show studio with his new album that I'm holding up here at Radio Audience called Braver Than We Are. It is Meatloaf here on the program. Good to yeah. see you, Matt. Rich, it is unbelievable been? to see you. And congratulations on this show. Dude. Thanks, Meatloaf. I appreciate that. Man, I watch it whenever I can. I, and I, I, I've never been so happy for anybody in my whole life. That's so nice of you to say. Thank you. I mean, I mean you deserve it. Thank I you. Mean, you were one of the best in the business. And, and it's like, wow. Got that, his own show. Meatloaf, I really appreciate that. I'm, I'm really no, jealous. I'm, I'm thrilled to see you because I haven't seen you in years. You and uh, you used to be a fixture, at least when I was covering it, at baseball All-Star Games every yeah. single year at Major League Baseball Yeah, and then Games. I started constantly working. Yeah. I never stopped. I didn't. I haven't stopped since 2007. Uh, there was one year I was home for two weeks. That's it? I did two movies and the rest tours, and and uh, I was home for two weeks in mm. one year. Right. And, and I, it wasn't even Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, man. And, uh, yeah, I mean, my last All-Star game covering at ESPN was the, the one where it was the tie in Milwaukee. That one, and then the year before. Oh, that's where we. That's where I was. Yeah, that's where we saw each other last. Then saw you there too. Because I played yeah. uh, played the softball game in Milwaukee. Yeah, and the, and you were kind of uh, off camera asking me if I married the girlfriend that I had there. Yeah, I said, did you marry the girlfriend? Yeah, we now have three children. You do? Yeah. And I said to you, she's hot. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm pleased to say she still is. I'm, I'm sure she is. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Meatloaf. I appreciate you saying all that. Um, so here we are now uh, on Fanatics Fan Day here on the Rich Eisen but Show. But I want to pick a bone with you. Okay, yes. Let's do that. Let's do this. About your top five. My 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 your, power your, rankings. Your power rankings. What do you have? A, I, I went uh, I went Carolina you went, 1. You went Carolina 1, which is fine. New England 2. New England 2, good. And then you had Pittsburgh 3. What's your problem with that? I, don't dis- I disagree with that. Yeah, and you're on Fanatics Fan Day here with Meatloaf. Keep this going, Mike Del Tufo. If you love your team, a player, or your city, check out Fanatics.com. Fanatics is the world's largest collection of official fan gear from all the leagues, teams, and players you love. Officially licensed everything Fanatics love never loses. Meatloaf, yes, here's a question I've always wanted to ask you. Keep okay. it going, Mike. How do you ever get Phil Rizzuto to do what he did for Paradise by the Dashboard Lights. Okay, great story. Knowing that he is basically calling the play-by-play of somebody to trying to but go from first to second that. to third base he to home. That. 